Well, all right, <laughs> thanks. Well, the Diocese of El Paso hosted its 25th annual binational mass prayer on the border today. ABC 7's Drew Cosgrave joins us now live from the studio with more on this event. Drew. People from El Paso, Las Cruces, and Juarez all gathered today to pray. They all prayed for all those who have lost their lives coming across the border. We uh, come at a time when, the, when we and Christians are praying in a special way for those who have died in their journey. During a stressful time for some who crossed the border, this annual mass brings one feeling to those who attended this prayer. I feel at peace, really, honestly. I feel really, like, calm. Bishop Mark Seat says there's a bigger picture at hand, though. We're also praying that we, we as nations might come to a, a more just and, and a orderly process by which people who need to cross can cross claim asylum and so on. Those who need to work can come and work uh, and, and in this way avoid the, 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 all the, so much of the pain that takes place when people have to flee from their homes. Cecilia Martinez, who attended the event Saturday morning, says it's moving witnessing all those who gather. Right here you're seeing a lot of people just coming together to celebrate the same thing. And it's kind of crazy how, you know, we're separated by a river and we can't cross simply because of a little piece of paper. Bishop Seats wants this message to hit home. A border is a human creation, but, but that there is a higher authority that also calls us brothers and sisters, children of God. And um, yes, we, we need borders, but even more important is that we remember that we're of the same human family. We treat each other that way. To learn more about Diocese and what they do, you can go on kva.com. Drew Cosgray, ABC7. All right, thank you very much, Drew. Still to come on ABC7, 